India Today's Nagarjun Dwarka now spoke with ISRO Chief V. Narayanan about Captain Shuk's spectacular achievement. Listen in to what he said. Your first comments on this historic splashdown of an Indian. Uh, you, as you are aware, this is the second Indian who has gone to space and came back safely. And first Indian went to International Space Station and came back safe. Now, it is a very historical and important moment. Now, first of all, I have to thank Honorable Prime Minister of India, Modi ji, for approving the Gaginian program on August 15, uh, 2018. And uh, he is the visionary leader who wanted the human spaceflight program. And we are working for the Gaginian program. For that, we have to develop the human rated launch vehicle, orbital module development, propulsion system development, uh, health monitoring system development, environmental control and safety system development, uh, crew escape system development, parachute development, human centric products like spacesuit, lot of developments. And one of the important aspects is giving, selecting the Gaganyatris, selecting yeah. the astronauts or Gaganyatris in our language, and train them for different, uh, different training giving exposure to the space environment and physical training, mental training, then a lot of education to them. And we had selected four Gaganyatris. They were announced to the country by Honorable Prime Minister just a year before last year end. Then it is Honorable Prime Minister, he strongly um, believed that one of the Gaganyatri better to send to International Space Station. What are the advantages? Advantages, number one, we selected two people uh, Prashant Nair and uh, Subhashnu Chikla Sukla. Ten months they were put through rigorous training program. So that is one of the outcome. Ten months training. Second thing, ISRO team has executed a contract, international contract for carrying out this. This is the second exposure what has come. Third thing is when uh, Sukla Ji and Prashant Nair, they had a contact with well Okay. Experience astronauts, they gain confidence. It is, yeah. this, this confidence, with that, they are going to the International Space Station. There, you know, already seven astronauts were there. And then yeah. they don't feel alone. So it is seven plus four, 11 people are there as a big team. So they work together. So he knows so, how to work in a team. And now he has come back. Now the entire yeah. experience, exposure, and he has seen the Earth from top. And uh, we allotted some work to carry out some experiments. Experiments, experiment is not only space experiment. Something was done in the ground, and it was uh, prepared right. and sent. He has done something, and the, for example, to take seeds after exposing to microgravity yeah. environment, it is brought back, and then yeah. anyhow, this we are going to do experiments. All these things will feed to Indian Gaganyaan program. So what are the key developments that you're looking or the learnings you're looking from this over two weeks mission that was carried out? What are the key features that you're looking to in inculcate key in Gaganyan programs? Work, work, work in a space environment, working together with other astronauts and carrying out some experiment, some experiments in the space environment other, along with other colleagues. Then, of course, getting exposed to that microgravity environment, the body itself getting exposed and what type right. of thing and the medical health. Medical health also we review quite often. So a lot of, you know, and we've got our input has come for our Gaganyan program. Shukla. So what, what is ISRO planning to welcome uh, Mr. Yeah, Shukla? So, when he comes, so what are the key developments that you're looking or the learnings you're looking from this over two weeks mission that was carried out? What are the key features that you're looking to in inculcate in Gaganyan programs? Work, work, work in a space environment, working together with other astronauts and carrying out some experiment, some experiments in the space environment other, along with other colleagues. Then, of course, getting exposed to that microgravity environment, the body itself getting exposed and what type right. of thing and the medical health. Medical health also we review quite often. So a lot of, you know, input has come for our Gaganyan program. Uh, you know, the team led by me when we were there for the launch, originally the launch was scheduled on 11th June. Correct. And 10th June, the moment we came to know there is yeah. a leakage in the rocket, we insisted on 
correcting the leakage before launch. So based on that, uh, correct. Uh, the launch was uh, postponed, and uh, postponed. they were also cooperative in correcting entire thing. Otherwise, it would have been a real problem without the correction. If the rocket would have taken off, there was a crack Correct. sitting there. It would have been a serious problem. And we are also fully satisfied. So we are having full knowledge of the system. And we could uh, insist on stopping a launch uh, with a serious problem. If that would not have been done, really it would have been a serious problem for safety of the all the four astronauts. And today I am so satisfied and happy that with our knowledge, Indian education system, Indian knowledge, we could really... Uh, insist on stopping a human rated rocket launch and they heard us because of Indian uh, knowledge. They heard us and stopped, postponed the launch and corrected in their thing uh, and safely we could launch. So we are fully satisfied on our education system, on Bharat education system and the capability of the Indians in ensuring That's safety of our own astronauts.